Hi beauties! This will be the final video in my Disney Good vs. Evil series and the movie I picked this time is Snow White. Uh, I'm not wearing the looks right now because I did each look on two different days but I will show you the final result of both of them. Um, so yeah, let's get started. To start off the Evil Queen look I'm first going to fill in my brows with this black gel liner from Makeup Geek called Immortal. I'm using the Sigma E65 small angled brush to apply it. And the Evil Queen has this round high arch and then it goes straight down from there. To help that gel liner stay in place, I'm going to apply Makeup Geek's Corrupt on top. Onto the eye makeup, first I'm going to apply Sigma's eyeshadow primer in Persuade. Then I'm going to cover my lid with NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in Purple Velvet. Now I'm blending that out using my finger. On each side of the lid I'm going to apply this dark purple eyeshadow from Coastal Sense in number CM09. Onto the middle of the lid I'm going to apply this lighter bluish purple eyeshadow from Makeup Geek called Unicorn. For my brow bone highlight I'm going to use Makeup Geek's eyeshadow in Vanilla Bean. Now I'm going to start drawing the crown and to do that I'm going to use NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in yellow. I'm going to go over that with Sugar Plus Eyeshadow in Butter Cupcake. I'm going to fill in the crown with Sugar Plus Chromalust in Gold Deluxe on a wet brush. Onto my lower lash line, I'm first going to place a little bit of Makeup Geek's gel liner in Poison. On top of that, I'm going to apply this limited edition eyeshadow from Sugar Pill. Now I'm lining my eyes with a liquid eyeliner. Now I'm going to use poison again to make some small red dots along my liner and this is a technique that I saw in a La Masca video and I thought it looked cool so I wanted to try it out. I'm just placing these spots randomly. On top of the red I'm going to apply Sugar Pills Chromalust in Asylum. Now I'm applying Immortal to the waterline and I'm setting it by using Corrupt. Now I'm applying some mascara. For false lashes I'm going to use Ardell in number 105. Here's the Evil Queen look all done.
I've already primed my eyes and I'm going to cut my crease using Makeup Geeks Gel and Erin Poison. Now at the outer corner here I'm going to create a bow. Now I'm going to go over that with Sugar Pills Eyeshadow in Love Plus. Now I'm going to use Makeup Geeks Gel Liner in Immortal to fix that bow a bit more. Above the black I'm going to apply this gorgeous blue color from the Sleek Ultramats version 1 palette and it's called Bolt. To blend that out I'm going to use this lighter blue from the same palette called Chill. I'm going to use Makeup Geeks eyeshadow in White Lies as a Ravon highlight. I'm going to cover my lid with Sugar Piss eyeshadow in Butter Cupcake. I'm also applying both to my lower lash line. Then I'm going over with the light blue. At the inner corner of my eye I'm going to apply Makeup Geeks Ice Queen. Now I'm lining my eyes using Immortal. I'm applying the nail dust glitter glue on top of the yellow. Over that I'm going to apply this Julie Deluxe glitter in Lemon Buzz. I'm lining my lower waterline with NYX Milk. I'm setting that by using Sugar Plus Eyeshadow in Taco. I'm applying some mascara. I'm going to use our Delphos lashes in number 118. Now the snow white look is all done. I hope that you liked both looks and also that you liked the series as much as I liked making it. Uh, thanks so much for watching guys and I'll talk to you soon. Bye bye!